Hello, I'm Leslie Richardson with Caligny Plaza, and I'm here today with my co-host, Heather Rath on Caligny Corner, and we're so excited to be back. Absolutely, it's great to be back. It's so fun. So what have you been up to, Heather? You and your darling family of three little boys, an amazing husband. What have you been doing? So we have had a um, really great uh, beginning of fall. You know, the weather has cooled down just a little bit just a little bit and we've been enjoying beach bike rides we are going to the full moon drum circles out at Coligny Beach that is super fun to do with the kids tell us about that tell so, everybody about that well you know um, every full moon there's a group that gathers out on Coligny Beach we always go over to Coligny Plaza and get food either from the pig or from the frog and just take it to the beach for a picnic and then we enjoy the full, full moon drum circle and playing the waves and it's always fun it's always on a school night um, so the kids obviously love that because they get to stay up a little bit later but that's something fun that's special here on the island that we can do and and you know it's so nice that even though we're into fall we can still have these like remnants of spring or summer um, so we have these um, moments at the beach we are of course drinking our signature drink today from skillets and we'll be celebrating their 25th anniversary absolutely. very exciting you too will get the recipe for this today absolutely and um, you know just doing fun things that when you live on an island you should do. So. Well, and I think what's so exciting about Caligny is we have so many things. I am thrilled. Everyone out there needs to go by and see the new center stage at Absolutely. Caligny. Absolutely. And now with John Cranford, who's running mm -hmm. Caligny Theater with us, he has so many ideas and so many activities besides just the incredible films that we'll be showing. Also a lot of events. I'm very excited because one of my college friends, who is a famous author on yes. entertaining, yes. Dee Dee Dalrymple, yes. will be coming to Caligny Theater in October. Everyone is invited to come. And we're bringing effortless entertaining to Caligny Theater. On October 10th, you're all invited. Dee Dee Dalrymple, who's a college friend yes, of mine, absolutely. and Hester Hotties, yep. who lives on Hilton Head, we're going to co-host the event at Caligny Theater. We're so excited about this. So tell me a little bit about effortless entertaining. I mean, I love to entertain, but I have kids. And so I hope that Dee Dee has some tricks for me. Dee Dee Dalrymple is the most beautiful entertainer, just so elegant. When you walk in her home and she's having an event, you just feel warm and wrapped up in hospitality. Awesome. And she has a 10-step point that I'm not going to tell you about, okay. but you need to come. I will be there. Put it on your calendar and invite all your friends on Absolutely. October 10th because we're doing so many amazing events at Caligny that will really be great for the community. And this is just one that'll help us all learn how to open our homes to other people. Fabulous, that's, that's wonderful. And thank you for bringing that. And I'm excited to meet Dee Dee. I've heard so much about her. We are very excited to be hosting that event at Caligny Theater. And we're excited to have you with us today. So let's talk a little bit about today. We are going to have Amy Bama from Skillet. Celebrating her 25th anniversary. Absolutely. We're so excited about we're, Skillet's at Caligny. We're excited to have her here. And she's going to be talking to us about her amazing stuff, French toast along with other goodies on our menu. And we're also having Kirsten from Benali's, who's gonna be talking about fall resort uh, fashion trends. Exciting. So that's great. Yeah. And then, of course, we'll have Patty Maurer who, from the Arts and Cultural Council of Hilton Head Island. They are hosting the month and a half long crescendo events. This is all Which things- Which is a fabulous arts event. Awesome. On Hilton Head Island. Absolutely. So month and a half long arts. We're right in the thick of it. And so there's lots going on. So we're excited that you're here with us today. We'll be right back. Hi, I'm Amy from Skillet's Cafe and Grill over in Caligny Plaza, and today I thought I would make for you a Coco Cabana. It's very easy, and it's ingredients that you probably ha even have at home. Go ahead and start with some ice. And we are going to use a nice Cruzan coconut rum for it. It's very refreshing, but it also goes into the fall really easily. Because who doesn't like the ingredients of pina colada mix and pineapple juice? We put Midori and the coconut rum in. You can use any brand of pina colada mix, or you can make your own as well. And then we just top it with pineapple juice. There we go. 
and obviously if you had some fresh pineapple or anything else you like, but we just kind of like to use an orange slice. And that is our Coco Cabana. Beautiful coloring, no straw because we're part of the strawless summer. And that is at Skillet's Cafe in Caligny Plaza, and it is the Coco Cabana. Hello, welcome back to Caligny Corner. We're so excited, we're with Amy Bama today, who has been at Caligny for 25 years. It's the 25th anniversary for Skillet's. Yes, And we're exciting. so excited to have you, and I was at your grand opening 25 years ago. Yes, And I so love now that. it's exciting to celebrate your 25th. 25. We that's, love you. That's Thank great. You. Thank you, it's been a wonderful journey. Great friends and family always around. Good. So today, so, I was what do you have say, for us? I thought I would bring the Caligny. Yay! That were I love and something Caligny named Corning. the Caligny. Absolutely. So, yeah, so what we do is one of our uh, skillet dishes. Okay. We take a layer of potatoes. We take nice Italian sausage. Oh, that look! I love how you've cut that cut up that so up. perfectly. Yeah, diced like a little cheddar cheese. Oh, everything is better with cheese. Definitely. On it. Yes. Yes. Uh, all of our skillets come with poached eggs, but you can of course order them scrambled or however which you is, like. Which wow. is what I always yeah. do when I'm in yeah. there. A biscuit. Awesome. Of oh, and the color. That That's beautiful. Yes. Yeah. Yes. So that is yes. the Caligny. Awesome. Oh, that beautiful. is delicious. Now, are we allowed to eat it right now? <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. Definitely. It's been on the menu since day one. Excellent. Um, so for 25 years, we have been selling the Caligny. And one of the favorites, right? Yes, definitely awesome. one of our favorites. So that's one that I always order, but again, I always order the uh, scrambled eggs on top, yeah. and then I do a little tiny side of hollandaise just to make it a little bit perfect. Oh, that sounds delicious, too. And, another and dish, what is this? Can I just slide that to you for a second? Another dish is our skillet stuffed French toast. Oh. And it's stuffed with apricots and cream cheese. That, being that looks I had the bakery amazing. Thank you. For so many years, um, it's a sweetened cream cheese that would you would find like in a cheese danish. So tell us what's a little bit different about this than you would find at other French toasts on the island. Well, the one thing that I think is really unique for us is we actually bake Italian bread oh, every day, gosh. let it sit oh, out to get stale. Oh, this is all fresh-made yes. bread that you make. We do, and then we let and it you sit make out the to sauce get stale in, inside. Too. Yep, we make all our own uh, filling for it. And then we grill it. We have our own uh, cinnamon milk sugar that we dip it in, let okay. it soak in there really good, and finish it, of course, with some powdered sugar. Oh, that looks delicious. And that is the apricot stuffed French toast. That's no also been No wonder your restaurant is always full. Thank you. I mean, thank the you. parking lot at Caligny is so full for all of your meals, and especially for breakfast, because these are really special items. They are, and we get a lot of people that walk up from the beach with their dog. Yep. And yes, and being dog friendly for you is, is a huge, huge So tell there. us about that. You allow dogs at your restaurant. We do, and we actually have our own dog menu. Yes. Um, and we have dog bowls. Don't worry, nobody's eating out of the dish you're eating out of. <laughs> um, so we have our own dog bowls as well. So I can come there with Girly this week. Yes, definitely. Oh, I am so excited because it's a really big deal. We all love our pets so much. Yes. And now that all of my three children have grown and moved <laughs> away, Girly is our little girl. So we're going to come and celebrate with you on your porch. And then you can have one of our house-made Bloody Marys oh, as we well. we love Bloody Marys. We, so tell us about your special Bloody Mary. We make our own Bloody Mary mix. It's, um, it's got a medium kick to it, okay. but you can also Get add, it a little bit spicier, right? You can, or you can use absolute papar in it or the effing cucumber mm -hmm. to give it a different taste as well. Right. Yep. We well, we excited. love, and of course, I'm sure you do Bloody Marys and Virgin Marys, yes, so somebody can have either way. Yes. But we love, and I love how you've done all the garnish. It's just, it's magnificent. It's like a piece of artwork. <laughs> thank you, thank you. And what other drinks do you make that are special? Well, we also have mimosas. Oh, and yes. I thought I would bring a mimosa and tell you all about our anniversary that we're having October 8th. At 10 a.m., I hope everybody comes up and joins us. Absolutely. And we're going to have a mimosa toast. Oh, fantastic. What time will the toast be? 10 a.m. 10 a.m. Okay, Great. we'll be there. Awesome. Let's do a little cheers right here. Cheers. Cheers Wonderful. to Skillet's 25 years. 25 years. Very exciting. So, also, what else? You're giving away something else at your grand opening. We are. So, for our anniversary, I've got tote bags. 
koozies. Oh, those are fabulous. Oh, look at this. Uh, for our dog. Oh, dog bandanas. Dog friendly. I love that. And we'll be open from 7 a.m. to 9 p.m. Excellent. That's great. And, and that's, that's on the twin on the October, on October 8th. 8th. But the whole week, 8th through the 12th, we're also doing 25% off all your food, breakfast, lunch, or dinner. Great. Oh, and are you doing any fabulous. other specials during the week or bringing back any other 25th anniversary menu items? Actually, we've kept pretty much all the menu the same. We've added to it, but all the original menu is still there, so we're very excited about that. Well, I just think that it's so great that one of your secret recipes is stale bread, to cook <laughs> it and then to have the stale bread um, a couple days later to make your French toast. So we appreciate you being with us here. We appreciate all the giveaways for your 25th anniversary and we will be right back. Welcome back to Caligny Corner, and we're here today with Kirsten Hansen. Welcome. Thank you. From Benali's, and I remember when Benali's opened, and Kirsten has a really fun story because the name Benali actually comes from Ben and Allie, who is your sister and brother-in-law. Correct. So welcome today. I Thank love you. your clothes, and I love that you have men and women's clothes, and I want to hear about the fashion coming up for the fall and what you have that we all need. So many fun things, lots of really neat colors this year. Mustard. Yes. Mustard. Most yes. people don't ever talk about mustard as a nice color. Mustard and marsala. So we're looking at Two lots. of the really quick, mm -hmm. nice colors for this year. Oh, so pretty. And mustard is always good for us brunettes. Brunettes wear mustard well, and yes. I love Marsala too. It's like that plum, purpley, but not quite there. Again, you've got something like this with the island feel. Yeah, it's got the tropical with flowers. With all the flowers on going you've on, you've got the mustard. You've got the beautiful blue that they're bringing in. Also, the grays and taupes, so you can fold it into fall and winter. And what's lovely about that top is that it's nice and um, just really breathable, and so Very you can wear it here on the island um, yes, all beautiful. through all through the fall, or your cruise, or wherever you happen to be going. Ooh. And I love anything that has a little touch of black, so that I can wear black separate pants or skirts or anything Perfect. with it. Well, in that it's really case, nice. let me show you a couple of options we've got. Ooh, I like with that. With a cute pair of black palazzo pants. This is a brand called Terra. Wire collar. You can fold it up. You I've never fold it, heard of a wire all collar. The way down. Oh, that. You can wear this as a nice, cute little overpiece. I love that. Something casual. Yes. Or you can wear it as a top by itself. And again, the little touch of mustard, a little bit of gray, and a little bit of black. So if you have your black leggings, you can wear it with that. Or if you want to go into your so trendy. Black I pants, like it. That's Another the one I yours. just bought. Oh, I yes. just bought this. That is. Fabulous. This is another one of theirs. Beautiful and one of our favorite features. I the love pockets. Pockets. Po pockets, love pockets. pockets. When she showed Great it to me and told me that there are pockets, I was like, sold, done. You must do the buying because you know what we <laughs> women want. I do part of it. <laughs> I'll admit. Yes. Okay, so another fun piece for fall that we wouldn't normally think of. But we know how the weather is here on the island. Yes. It's nice and warm, and it can be very warm late into fall. These are the darker colors that are showing up Love this the year. Love the fabric. The fabric is great. Easy wear, easy care, perfect to take on vacation. It's so packable. It won't wrinkle, which exactly. I like. And I like how it folds down, and you and can I, tell really small. And I'm just looking at the color comparison, and look at that. Oh, that is so such How a great outfit. And that's I a love great all the fall. accessories. I mean, that would be a great um, event outfit for all of our fall festivals. Absolutely. You have the little tinge. And look of the at wool. these, look at these beads. This is really heavy. This is very elegant. It's a very nice And you designer. sell all of these yes. at Benali's. We do. And I love how they coordinate. It's fun when you go in there, you'll help people put outfits together. Absolutely. That is our specialty. Mm -hmm. We really like to help people have the pretty woman experience, whether it's a man or a woman. Okay, so you will put everything together head to toe. We tap. help them fit hats, which come by the eighth inch. Oh, let's talk about your hats. So real quick, one of the most popular hats, and these are actually unisex. Okay. 
this is the Hiker's Hat by Tilly. And it, Tilly is so famous. People will come to find you to find a Tilly they hat. They need to find a Tilly. They are 100% guaranteed for life with normal wear and tear. Great. They float. Mm -hmm. This has a device in the top. You soak it in water for five minutes and then you put it in the freezer for a couple of hours and it will send that cool dissipation as Talk you wear about it. keeping a cool head. Exactly. Which I company like need like that? Benali's. Yeah, we I need those. I have to get that yes. for my husband. He loves to kayak and so that would be the perfect thing for him to kayak with. Great. Well, and also you can get him a pair of shoes. I know. I love these shoes. I love the them. And they're the shoes. orthopedic yeah, shoes. They're orthopedist design. They're great for aligning the spine. But then we also have our nice reversible shoes for women in Mazzori. Which is so I you love the design them, of that shoe. Inside oh, out. you're kidding me. So when you go oh, to you pack have a for silver the and a gold yes. shoe. I Look love that. that. And you can wear these all day long. A woman designed them. Great, nice. They look so sport. comfortable. They're wonderful. So oh. what colors do those come in? Because I know when people travel, they really like to have the gold and the silver or the black and the gray or the we black carry, and taupe. We carry a variety of styles mm -hmm. so that you have black to taupe, oh, you have great. the metallics, you have everything else. So Thank you item. so oh, yes. much. Oh, look at that. Yushi Cowell. And the I seashell. love the necklace. Heather, that would look great with what you have on. Absolutely. It Let's see that necklace on you. I think Those you might need that top. Those are all hand Okay. Dyed seashells. Wow. And crystals. Seashells. They're beautiful. Beautiful. Oh, Kirsten. Well, we want everyone to come in and meet Kirsten and let her show you we the beautiful clothes at Benali's. And you can organize them and put them together with great trendy fashion. We love to do that. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for joining us, Kirsten, and we'll be right back. Hello, I'm Kirsten from Benali's Coastal Wear, and I would like to show you just a sampling of a few ways to wear this vest that is painted by artists. It takes them three days to paint each one by hand. There are 16 different ways to wear it. You can wrap it on one side. You can also tie it on the other. You can wear it upside down if you don't want to do the long vest. Maybe you're a little more petite and aren't comfortable with that longer length. This also makes a great wrap if you want to wear a dress to, say, the opera or maybe the new symphony that we've got featured in town. One of my favorite absolute ways to wear this. Throw it over your head. And look at this nice dramatic poncho look that you have to go over any evening dress or just over a pair of jeans and a, a t-shirt. Final way, twist it, put it over your neck, you've got a scarf, you wear it long and fluffed, get tossed over your shoulder for a little drama. So just a reminder, there are over 16 different ways to wear this. Come see me or any of my girls at Benali's at Caligny, and we'll be happy to show you how to wear them. Welcome back to Caligny Corner. I'm your host, Heather Rath, and I'm here with Leslie Richardson and Patty Maurer from the Arts and Cultural Council of Hilton Head Island. Patty, welcome. We are so excited for the Arts and Cultural Council to present Crescendo. And we're so excited that Caligny Plaza is a sponsor of Crescendo. We are just thrilled with this amazing six-week festival and we want to hear how you came up with the name and how you came up with the timeline and everything. Okay, so the Arts and Cultural Council last year decided to last two Mays ago, decided that we wanted to put together a, a festival and, cr and bring together all of the organizations and we came up with Crescendo. We, some of our members wanted to go back to the old Bravo, but we thought, well, no, we're not reinventing. Sure. So, you know, we came up with Crescendo, and we, we put, paired it with National Arts and Humanities Month, which is in October. 
So what we did is then we couldn't just stick to the one month long thing because then we were going to miss you know, we went on low country time. We were missing our <laughs> low country time. Yeah, low country I months, love that. Six weeks. I but love that. We wanted to include the Concord. Yes. And the Absolutely. opening weekend of the Nutcracker, which are staples here. You're on so Hill inclusive Island. with Crescendo. I Absolutely. think that's so important. So it's a celebration of arts, culture, history, everything Hilton Head Island for about six weeks. And we're in the thick of it. So tell us some of the fun things that are happening. So uh, right now, um, theater wise, we have um, Hunchback of Notre Dame, awesome. which is uh, first we have the Main Street Youth Theater and um, May River Theater because May River Theater lost its home and they've come over to Hilton Head. Oh, oh, wonderful. Oh, that's I wonderful love that there. sense I love, of community yeah, with I love Crescendo. May River Theater. So yes. it's bringing the community, an adult community theater yes. and pairing it with the youth theater here. Great. And so they're running out of Main Street? They're going to be, it's actually going to be at the high school. At Excellent. the high school theater. Great. And, um, and then what else do we have? We have so many things. We have the small uh, drawing workshops yes. through the Art League that are very Can intimate. anyone sign up for those? Yes. You can go online, hiltonheadartsdaily.org, and visit it every day. There are things to view, things to do, and things to learn. And they are our- Say that again. I love that. Things, things to, to view, do, things, things to do, and, and things, things to, to learn. learn. So I love this celebration of arts, culture, history, music, everything on Hilton Head Island. And I love that it's taking place over a six week period. We're in the thick of it. So we have the Freedom Isn't Free uh, Forum coming up with Mitchellville. We have History Day sponsored by Coligny Plaza. We have the Petal Hilton Head Island event, which John Cranford is throwing a concert on top to, of a bike event. Again, uh, sponsored by Caligny Plaza. They're going to be doing music of the Grateful Dead at Caligny Theater. That's going to be so much fun. John Cranford is so creative. We've Absolutely. really enjoyed mm -hmm. having him at Caligny Theater. Absolutely. And we also, um, you're going to have Amadeus at Absolutely. the Art Center of Coastal yeah. Carolina. Yes. Yeah. And we're so excited because uh, the Art Center has offered a field trip performance for the students to come. Oh, outreach and, for the children. Yes, and they Wonderful. have sent out study guides. The Island School Council for the Arts has funded some students and the Spear Family Foundation. And so we have that packed house for the field trip performance. So, and I love what Crescendo is doing is it really reaching out in the community, which is so wonderful. Well, and also we're very excited to have the symphony Yay! in Caligny Yay! with sound yeah. waves. Sound so waves. I know they'll be really involved in a lot yes, of events. So do. one more time, tell everybody where they can go and get the information. Okay, so visit Hilton Head Arts Daily dot org and you can find things to do things to view and things to learn every single day here on Hilton Head Island great well thank you thank so you much. so much Patty thank you so much Patty for being with us and um, this is this is really great for our community so thank you for taking this on and for sharing it thank you for having me and we'll be right back that was so much fun we loved having all these wonderful guests today on Caligny Corner. Thank you so much for tuning in. And thanks for doing this with me again, Leslie. And we're so excited to be in the middle of fall and um, excited for Halloween at Caligny. That's coming up and all sorts of fall fun. So thank you so much for joining us and we'll see you next time on Caligny Corner.